Keep the change, you filthy animal. What? Already 10 out of 10. Anytime a saxophone presents itself in a video game, it's already a fucking 8 or a 9 at least. Okay. So this is the, the two characters. This is Sam, and this is Max. I only know that because not only is it telling me this, I remember the thing from Team Fortress. Wow, an actual celebrity vandalizing our neighborhood. This is great! Remember when you were famous? <laughs> remember when you were famous? You're under arrest! I don't- look, I don't care who you are. I don't care what you're doing, where you've been. You are committing a crime. You're under arrest. By the way, we're freelance police, and you're under arrest. No, I've really got to finish this. But thanks anyway. What? Um... That's not how it works. Sludgies. <laughs> With 100% all-natural sludge! This week's flavors, wheatgrass and meatloaf. Wheatgrass and meatloaf smoothies. Alright, I'll tell you. One of those doesn't sound too bad. I'm not gonna tell you which one. It could be either one of them. Nachos. They're mine, nachos! Oh, yuck. Yuck! That was a yuck joke. I need to hear nachos. it again. They're mine, nachos! Nachos. They're mine, nachos! Oh, yuck. Brady Culture's eyeball is the ocular fitness regimen for people on the go. It's gonna be like a hypnotizing program where you get like all fucked up and it makes you paint, um... I, I was gonna say giraffes, but it was it's graffiti, that's the word. There's a lot of G's and a lot of F's in both those words. Who exactly who is, is this he? Brady Culture fellow supposed to be? And what kind of steroids does he use on his hair? Brady Culture is a genius, and his eyeball program is yeah. a boon to Settle all Settle down, mankind. Jeremy. You got the fucking, you got the intelligence like a large glass of water. Often. And did you know 12 ounce IQ. Culture's clubhouse in 1970? That's mine, by the way. I said that in pre-stream uh, pre chat. It's a child star bonanza. <laughs> you failed it. <laughs> I was waiting. I was waiting for an opportunity to use it. Yeah, that, yeah, yeah, you, yeah, you know, you're brilliant. No, you, you're brilliant. You got the fucking IQ like a glass of water. And then they're going to be like, what the fuck is he talking about? And then on the car ride home, the car ride home, they're going to be going, Whoa, fucking like 16 ounces, that motherfucker! <laughs> I, was trying to, I was trying to like plant the gun in there. I don't know why. Do you have any exiled political dissidents? Nope. Do you have any weapons of mass destruction? <laughs> Who's asking? Topical, topical humor! Do you have any- Topical! Humor? Do you guys remember bringing in your report card into Chuck E. Cheese? You guys ever have that deal? Where if you had like A's? Yeah, Chuck E. Cheese used to do this thing like 10, 20 years ago. Where if you brought in your report card and you had A's? Straight A's! They would give you free tokens. They would give you a, a bonus tokens. So, but what they didn't tell you is that really didn't matter because they didn't want anybody to feel bad. So we would go in, my mother, I'm, I, I was a bad student, so I didn't get like, a, I, I, it, was, it wasn't A's and B's by the way, it was like uh, S or something for satisfactory uh, needs improvement. There were only like three grades. A for like uh, accomplished or something. So I, would, I had a terrible report card. But we still wanted to go to Chuck E. Cheese, and we would go, and my mother would still try to get them to give the bonus credits for having a good report card. And the guy behind the counter, like, just didn't give a shit, so like, they, they felt bad, because they would get my brother's report card, and they'd be like, Oh, he's doing great! Free! 20 free tokens! And then they'd get mine, and you could see the guy's face just be... Ugh. Hey! Psych! Uh, good for you! 20 free tokens! I just got- I got them just because they felt bad. And I don't know, maybe- maybe my mother was like, you- you give them both that, you understand? I don't want him thinking that he's like, a fucking inadequate. And the guy's just like, okay. What conversation? <laughs> the leech. conversation we just I just- had. I just accidentally no, skipped see, that. He was just acting he's like he leeching off his brother. <laughs> this, is, this is like a dumb- like, four dollar extra promotion at Chuck E. Cheese 20 years ago. Oh wow, I can't believe he did that to his brother. Unbelievable! 
He like conned his brother out of tokens. Is there any consequences? Are there no consequences? Take the wheel, buddy. <laughs> Why can I do this? Relax. That may be the least relaxing sign I've ever seen. Relax. What about the one at the barbershop that says low fatality rate? I stand corrected. I would, I would never let somebody shave me. I have this extreme fear of being shaved by somebody. And it's completely irrational, and you can judge me all you want. But I imagine myself sitting in the barber chair and talking to whoever it is that's, that's shaving me currently. And they just like, Effie! And I'm just dead. I don't know why, I just always think about that. Plus, I have a very sensitive face. I gotta be very careful, like... I use a very specific particular razor. If I go and do a, like a hot shave and they're just like, Here we go! I can, I cut up there, I cut easily on my face. I know, no, no. They get like the, the, the thing, they have a towel and they have that piece of leather that they take the big knife, it's like a machete, and they go <laughs> uh, Put your head back! Hideously broken tail light. Indecent exposure. We're booking you, sorry, Hyde, for indecent exposure. What are you talking about? I'm fully clothed. Except your face. Get a veil, please. Let's go, Max. Having that face is punishment enough. <laughs> That's two cops. Two police officers say that to you? <laughs> hey, you're naked. No, I'm not. Well, you're ugly. Bye. Okay. Have a nice day, officer. Jesus. Sam one, tail light zero. Wow. It's gonna bolt. I could do this all day. <laughs> oh, God. Pull over. You have two broken tail lights. Hello, sir or madam. You're in big trouble, Mister or Miss. For what? Your tail light's busted. But well, you're the ones who broke it. Your point being. Hmm. What's the fine for a broken tail light? Ten thousand dollars. Ten thousand dollars. <laughs> what? Are you crazy? What? Oh, uh, one moment. Allow me to confer with my legal counsel. My attorney has advised me to pay the fine. Wait, what kind now, of inflation is economy to have some here. accounting to do? Yeah, you got to figure if you would just pay that fine, something fucked up is really going on in your current life. You will have to be like a super criminal. There's probably like. Five hundred thousand dollars worth of cocaine in that person's car or something. Hello. I got a million dollars in fucking like cocaine in this car. That'll be ten thousand dollars. Okay. Yeah. Doesn't mean you're gonna leave me alone. Yeah. Okay. Bye. <laughs> I can see you. Whoa. What? Go. <laughs> hey, there he is. You attacked a license cycle. Just comes naturally. They got a big fail safe in the game's engine here to make that not possible. Let's get psychoanalyzed on Take stream. Take a look at go. this and tell me what you see. Uh, that's Goro from Mortal Kombat. About to do a fatality to me. I, it's a point of view. Okay, without even looking at this is two old ladies. These are two old ladies with their hands up. So they see like the big bun hair, two cigarettes, two old ladies back to back. About to do a duel with cameras. The selfie dueling. Okay, this one. Again, I see two. It's either okay. It's either. Uh, Oros from World of Warcraft, like the light things. Some of you will get that. Or, there's another. It's there's the nose, the face, his hand coming out like two dancing, like dueling dancing. To like circus performers or back to back here with doing selfie selfie uh, duels. Uh, this is a Pokemon. This is when it goes like do do do, and it zooms in, and then it, it fades into color, and they go like, Mujito. This has been somebody fucked up Pokemon's. I guarantee you, if you superimpose a Pokemon that looks like this on, it, they're they're out of like the sixteen thousand Pokemon that exist now. One of these matches, Pokemon, is the Simpsons of monster character creation. If you think you made up something, they already have done it. It's just that joke. 
Do you? Oh, do you have like an original monster animal thing that you've drawn? No, there's a Pokemon. There's already like 30,000 of a database has been made. We should test you for the other symptoms of APD. Whatever you say, Buddy. Sawbones. Buddy. I'm not a Sawbones. I'm a psychotherapist. Tomato, Isn't it weird when tomato. you say the word money? Hey, I'm getting hungry. I don't know why, but sometimes I don't know what it is. Money. Like what happens when you face so you face and do it? Say money. Like your your nose scrunches and your like up your upper lip goes up. Like money. Money. It's it's a weird fucking word. Money. I'll show you. Ready? Watch my face. Um Dog. Cat. Hammer. Money. Ball. Dream. Uh, car. Money. 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 Closet. Money. Race track. Baby. Money. Holy shit, Germa's average dong. Germa average dong is trying to reach Germa's massive dong status. More community subs. Local streamer <laughs> writes off penis on tax form as a dependent. <laughs> Imagine trying to pulse it. I mean, that, what would you... Okay, if you were at the IRS and you saw that, What'd you do? You, would you laugh or would you be like annoyed? I'm not sure. Is that them? All right. Well, I could, their car probably is very, very slow. I get in my car. Or can I just grab them when they drive by? Where are we going, Sam? Hey. Extra dogs. <laughs> the skin buddy. Ten more dogs. After those rats. It's not an average dog anymore. It's 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 two. It's too big. No, I, I just said that. No, but listen. It's a lot of money. Try to drive him into something? Simpson. That was a bad Grandpa Simpson, but it's very loud. What do aliens do for romance? Do they love? How do they get their otherworldly thrills? By playing slots in Kino? That'd explain why they're always seen in Nevada. <laughs> no, you got me woke up. Who else is an alien? Is anybody else an alien that we might not know about? Dr. Phil. Well, that goes without saying. I can see that. That would make sense. Dr. Phil really does come off as the kind of guy that, after the show, and that's the whole thing. See you next time when we analyze someone else. Get off of here. Get out of here. You're a, you're a dumb idiot. Get out of here. And he goes backstage and like... <laughs> his skin just fucking falls off of him. And he like gets in a bath. An alien bath. What's in an alien bath? It's a regular bath. Except there's an alien in it this time. And they add like other like spices in it and shit. There's like the coriander and like cumin and fucking like cilantro. Alright, let's look at some of this stuff. She's got a story here about two hygienists from Walla Walla and an amorphous Saturnian slime mold. There's like oregano in it. Is that the one where they walk into a bar Tabasco and sauce and shit? They put like all kinds of weird but stuff in you're it. close. That's not even weird. That stuff's like good. What am I talking about? A memograph! to be some sort of reproductive device. I love it's a <laughs> Yeah, I do. I use it to print my tabloid. Nice cactus. Saguaro? Vinyl. Hey, if you dip that in ink, you could do 30 tattoos at once. <laughs> if I could scare up 30 customers Cilantro at once, just tastes like I'd I'm eating grass and chemicals. <laughs> yeah, only us aliens know what it tastes. You have to be an alien to like cilantro. It's kind of weird because cilantro, the way cilantro smells, I don't want it near me. It's kind of like the, the way that I think a mosquito feels when you have off on your body. If cilantro comes near me, I'm like, no, get that away. I don't want him, I don't want to near me. Off. O F F. Off. You don't know what off is. Off. The spray. The mosquito spray. The you put it all over your body. Off. O F F. It's the na number one name brand mosquito repellent in the world, probably. You don't use raid on your body. You use off. 
Are you trying to tell us you don't like this? No, don't use raid. Raid money. Director's chair. Let me sit in that. And see how it feels. It's got a falling star. <sighs> Twinkle, twinkle, little feels star. Feels pretty good. How I wonder how you'll crash and burn. Uh, yeah. No, no, don't make, don't make me do it. Don't make me do it. De -de 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 no. <laughs> All right, I dog, I got it. I'm fine. So, uh, I'm at the dentist today, right? Sit down. We're going over some stuff. I do some X-rays, and I'm lying, blind back, and they have a a TV on the wall. Some dentists do this now. They have, I don't know, like monitors all in in each room. So I'm sitting there, and it, there's Netflix on it. And oh, okay, cool. This is pretty, this is actually a pretty cool idea. You just have, can have like TV there. Like that's fucking ridiculous. That's really really awesome. So. <laughs> the dentist is just like, hey man, like, yeah, while you're waiting, while you're chilling around, while, you, while we're doing some stuff, you know, you can uh, just, just browse and uh, put on whatever you want. I'm like, okay, cool. And f the, you know how you can see, like, what people have seen already on Netflix? And uh, the queue of stuff that has already been watched? One of the last things that was on was a bunch of horror movies, like Friday the 13th, like Freddy? Why the fuck would you ever watch Friday the 13th when you were getting dental work? That's ter it's terrifying. It was like at least two or three fucking messed up horror movies. And I'm just sitting there going, imagine lying there and watching like Jason tear somebody in half with like a chainsaw while there's a guy in your mouth like, with dentist tools. And I don't know if anybody else is like this, but... I have this weird thing where I don't want anyone to know the things that I want to watch on TV. Is that weird? I hovered over a show about wine. And I, di I didn't want to put it on. Because it was like a wine documentary. And I, I just felt like people were going to judge my taste or something. I, I'm trying to think of what's the most normal background thing I could possibly put on. I'm scrolling through... You've got, uh, home, re fix it, and then sell it. But I'm like, that's too normal. That's, like, too weird. Why would I watch that show? And I'm like, oh, how about, like, a food show? Ah, those are, those are really easy. Just put on, like, a food documentary about, like, sushi. But I, why would I watch that while I'm getting my, like, teeth, like, looked at? No. I, could, I it was freaking me out. I'm just sitting in the chair. I, I don't know what to put on. And then I scrolled over like animation. Like what's like is the animated show? No. Like what if I put on like a kid show? I don't want to put on like a kid show. Why are you watching like a kid show? Why? What are you weird? No, no. I just I don't know what to put on. How it's made, but uh, and what? Okay, what? And then I was thinking how funny it would be if I did, if I put on like a dentist documentary. <laughs> I was thinking, would that be funny? These are the dentist is like, oh yeah, go ahead, put on whatever you want, and I put on like a dentist thing. Like a dentist show? Would that be weird? Would they think I was fucking crazy? What's a- what is a fucking dentist show? There, there is no dentist show. I'm just- th that's a whole nother question. First of all, there's a ton of doctor shows. House, uh, Nip Tuck, you got ER. Where are the dentist shows? Why is there no big dentist drama? Alright, what, what am I gonna making, make? Sam? A casserole- a cake! Yep, 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 yep. Today we're baking yeah, a cake. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's visit our rack of ingredients. I'm so fucking and pumped up right now. I gotta slow. I gotta I'm calm down. Sure I'm that's fucking hyped up. <laughs> Asbestos. Sulfuric acid. Sulfuric acid sparingly. It can easily overwhelm the other ingredients. And your taste buds and your Asbestos, sulfuric acid, and lard. How about another picture, you bliss? How about this? Instead of a new picture, we'll just recycle the old one. Save the Earth. Alien. Sure, whatever. Gather round. Got him. Exposed. Ladies and gentlemen, we got him, right? Remember that one? When a contestant comes to the podium, just read him a question from the card. Then, when he gets it wrong, insult him and tell him to get off the stage. Oh, no, no. Prismatology teaches us to love everyone, no matter what. Right, just read the cards. Okay. I still love You're 12 you. 12 months late. I'm doing <sighs> a, I'm doing an ironic bit about how, like, if everyone knows that and everyone's done in a bunch of videos and stuff. It's, it's irony. 
You guys wouldn't know irony. Only thing you know about irony is ironing your clothes in the morning or something. Hmm. The question is, am I blue? Um. I don't think so. No, Hugh, you're not blue. Oh dear! Oh me, oh my! That's absolutely right! Yes. Congratulations! You're a millionaire! <laughs> We're rich! Filthy I didn't know if the game may have thrown a curveball at me and it's like he's sad. So he, he's he's so happy. Look at how happy he is. Oh, this is awkward, but we don't actually have a million in cash. Sweet mother of all quiz show scandals. We'll have to give you a million dollars worth of food stamps. They're right over there. What? One, two, three, 174, 175, 999,999, and a million. Let's go spend it, Sam. It's burning oh. a hole in my pocket. It's putting quite a bulge in mine. A bulge, but he says bulge. Yo, 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 yo. He says it is. Yes, it is a bulge. Yeah. He says he's got something I'd be perfect for. I fear, Kurt. You don't feel uncomfortable getting a case first and then being a witness for it? <laughs> it really is. Not at all. You see, the problem with most trials is that crimes are witnessed by someone who's unprepared for what's going to happen, or who doesn't have sufficient training or Here's skills the weird to thing about what you just remember said. or relate what happened. With my background and widely varied I... skill set, I'm perfect. I know what that means. That makes sense. Should but I, I don't know how. Probably. It's, it's, it's like a Guy Fieri. Is his shirt? Or the car? Is that tattoo? That image is just synonymous with Guy Fieri, and I can't put on to why. Relax. 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 Whee! Relax. Hey, this guy Fury, he got Fury, does the carpet match the drapes? No, oh, that's killer. Oh, that's out of the park, man. If you're taking off, I will say see you soon. I'm not gonna be live for about a week. What is today? Today's technically this is Saturday. So I'm probably, you're probably not gonna see me until somewhere around Friday. I'm gonna be gone for almost a full week. Don't forget about me. You're not gonna forget about me, right? You're not gonna- I'll be back, I'll be back real soon, not even a week! I'm trying to adjust the white balance. Look, I live in Las Vegas, it's been hot, the sun's been shining, I got a sunburn. Look, see, I'll prove it. See, look. See? Look at that! So I went to the dentist, a couple weeks ago, and I did part one of, of my procedures that I was gonna do. Had some x-rays, had some, uh, had some things done, came back for part two today, and what did I talk about, uh, what was in the dentist? Two weeks ago. That I made a big deal about. Uh huh. There was a television in the dentist office. No, not teeth, right? So in this dentist office, there is a TV with Netflix on it. Remember, I said, oh, I wonder what people watch when they get their teeth done. I made, I made that very specific comment. Anyways, today I'm in the dentist office. Earlier today, this is like four hours ago. So I get the remote, and I've got some work to do. So I'm gonna be there for like an hour or so, right? Maybe a little bit more. So I go back in the chair, and while I'm going back, I'm told, put on whatever you want. And I kind of panicked a little bit. I didn't know what to put on. So I put on something safe, a nature documentary. Again, yes, I panicked again. I do this every time. So I put on a nature documentary, and it's the episode, I didn't care what the fucking episode was called. The episode was called Recording. It was like a BBC documentary. I'm gonna describe it. You may have already seen it. So, courting is on the screen. This is just playing. Netflix is just sitting there. Thankfully, the volume's not turned up very high at all. So I'm in the chair, going back. Things are normal, and I'm glancing over at this TV every now and then. Remember, dentist is fucking in my mouth. Like <laughs> dentist is in my mouth doing these things. Dentist is in is. The, uh, dentist is drilling. No, he's not drilling. <clears throat> dentist is using tools inside of my mouth. So. <laughs> God damn it. Why? 
So the dentist is working in my mouth while the, the Netflix documentary is playing. So he's, you know, doing his thing. He's like, you're talking, oh yeah, so let me see this. Let me see, I can uh, turn this way, please. I glance over at the TV and there are two turtles having sex on the TV. Just fucking on screen. And I'm like this. And remember, the TV's over here. So I really have to like look hard and there's two turtles just going at it. And remember, the episode was called The Courting. I, I'm okay, you know, it doesn't take, uh, sometimes it's really easy for me to laugh and get into a laughing fit, but whatever, that's fucking nature, it doesn't matter. He's sitting there, still doing his thing, okay, uh-huh, 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 yeah, 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 no, are you, are you, oh, you okay, you okay, yeah, 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 uh-huh, uh-huh. Little do I know that this keeps going. The two turtles are having sex, another turtle, another turtle comes from behind the other turtle, and starts punching this turtle in the back of the head over and over again. Uh, and I'm like, ah! why? Why is it hard? I'm telling you, this is like CIA, CIA level training that I had to go through here to not laugh while the guy was fucking in my mouth doing things. That's not the end of the story. So I'm going like this. Huh. 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 And what do I see again while I fucking peer my eyes down? Another turtle shows up. Just what I think I was out of the woods here. Another fucking turtle starts to fight the rest of the turtles and one of two of them having sex with each other. It got to a point where I was like, <coughs> and he's like, are you okay? And I'm like, yeah, I, 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 you, you got, I just got some water back here in my mouth. This is just animals having sex on the screen behind him. He didn't even know. This is at the dentist. I've tried to put on some say, and here's the worst part about that. I'm gonna, I'll end the story and we'll move on, but here's the worst part about that entire thing. If I had just put on something like Cupcake Wars, I would have cracked and laughed at that show for some reason. I was able to keep it together during the animals having sex. All right, well, let, let me break down what, what we, this is the, this is, we're in the middle of episode three. So if you're wondering, wait, what the hell's going on? Why you, we just jumped right in. It's because this is the middle of the episode. We are tasked with doing three things. We have to kill Sybil. is one of them, but we're not going to do that. That's one of the things we have to do. So we have three tasks that we need to fake, I'm assuming. Is there like a way I can... Oh my god, I did it again. It's been like two or three weeks and I tried to leave through the closet again. Okay, but be sure to stock up. God damn it. Look, I had a rough day, all right? Are you supposed to Don't drink worry, after Bosco. the dentist? We'll help you purge this place of mafia contraband just as yeah, soon as we whatever. solve this case we're so incredibly busy with. Oh yeah, you're real busy. You done nothing but loiter around my store all day. What can we say? We love to loiter. Only water? Oh, you mean uh, so ice coffee? Mobsters, right? Not yet. Our journey to the dark side has just begun. I fucking hate being on camera. Follow my lead. Your mom is so fat, she plays pool with the planets. A classic. Your mom is so fat. She plays, where is it? Your mom is so punctual, thrifty, perky, rated. These are all good qualities. I mean, uh, this one, unless we're talking about in the morning. You know what I mean? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It's probably this one. She's just thrifty. She brings... Coupons to the Penny Arcade. She brings coupons to the Penny Arcade. Oh, Mama, make it stop. Why is he turning red? He's getting closer to oh, breaking. He's Let's blushing. keep it up, little buddy. Yeah. We we like we got the same tone here, don't we? This is now when I see it in real time, I know what you're saying now. I just have to has to see I have to see it for myself. You know what I mean? Lawful good and raffle good. What would raffle good even mean? You're not the guy that does anything bad or good, you just laugh at the jokes? No, you laugh at clean, good jokes. You don't Welcome laugh at, like, dirty, Teddy mean Bears. jokes. Mafia free. Playland Brothel Evil would be you you, you laugh us. at, like, mean shit. Where the mafia plays for free. And Ruffle Neutral means you, you decide between, you know, laughing at, you know, maybe you think something is funny, but you shouldn't, but you still laugh at it. The sun has scorched his brain. I have the cap gun, though. Cap gun, coffee, shoot, okay, this is where we're getting some knowledge here.
cap gun makes the bang. She falls back and pretends to die, screams. It's all on camera. I'm going to walk up to her. I'm going to go, listen, Sybil, this is what we're going to do. I'm going to shoot you with this cap gun. And then Max is going to scream in obscenity. He's right. I will. Easy, little buddy. Can you add more space to the side of your head, though? Oh, my OCD's killing me. Yeah, I'll, I'll fix it. What, did you want more? Or Oh, oh you talk about over here. I see what you mean. There you go. Perfect. Can you make your head a little wider? Yeah, and why, is it too thin for you? Yeah, I can do that. Make it a little bit wider? Like, yeah, I mean, if that makes you comfortable and happy, I don't want to make, you know. Dude, can you bet? It's not fitting my widescreen TV. Oh, fuck, that's right. We got 4K televisions now. I forgot. I'm sorry, guys. I, I know, I'm just I'm still trying to get the hang of this. That should fit the 4K screen, right? Hold on. I've got half. Holy shit, look at how fucked up I look. This is like uncanny valley. Just what do you think you're doing? Looks like he missed her. Can I shoot the coffee cup and have the blood go everywhere? <laughs> what? Did what? No, that's not how that works. What? No, I just actually killed her. It wouldn't block the bullet. I actually killed her. Can I drop something on him? Wait, hold on, hold on. I think I got it. Don't worry, they're using a cap gun. We'll be fine. One, two, three. That guy's dead. That guy's dead. And he'll get he'll get zoinked up and dragged over. Is he too big for this? Oh no! He's clogging up the chocolate vent. Nice work, Sam. Thanks, pal. I don't think that mold The whole thing has been contaminated. Really, though. In fact, look. We have to replace all that chocolate. And here is the protagonist. No, the antagonist the secret agent of chuckles. the next. The factory's been one. destroyed. Repeat, the factory has been destroyed. Commence plan B. <laughs> he hits his head backwards with the camera. The fuck, man? I have a perfectly symmetrical face. I do not. I do not. Actually, no, I don't. I'm gonna prove it to you right now. So, you see, my face looks like... So, if we take a look at this angle, here. My nose comes down, it actually goes this way. So my nose actually goes in a, in a completely different direction. So my, my nose crosses here. My mouth here goes down, right? So as you see, this is a straight on of my face. When we turn this way, the chin is more pronounced here, and the nose points over here, right? Or the, uh, sorry, this way. This eye socket is out a little, and when I turn this way, notice how the nose is pointing this way, and this eye socket is back. And my chin points down a little deeper this way. Uh, some of you have uh, made fun of my face this way because it looks like a banana, and it, it's very rude and very mean. But uh, I think this is my good side. This is, I mean, you could, uh, maybe, uh, it depends. This could be my good side too. You know, the little deeper set eye there. They're both good sides, I think. They're just both very different. You don't have a good side. My mother would disagree with you. 